Kia ora all, I'm Bridie and this week on Avonside Aroha, the exec team and I are back again sending you some exciting news and helpful tips. As always, we're wishing you all the best with your Level 3 lockdown learning and hope that you and your bubbles are staying safe and well. Also, remember that we're all in this together and you can reach out for the support of your family and friends, poako, kaitiaki and of course our awesome wellbeing team whenever you need to. I've been amazed by all the entries coming in so far for our recent competitions and encourage you to keep up the great work. And remember those cool prizes up for grabs too? That's all thanks to the team at Be The Change. Be The Change has been inspired by anti-bullying programs all over the world and works on a preventative approach to one of New Zealand's highest rated social issues, bullying. They strongly believe in the five ways of well-being, connect, give, take notice, be active and keep learning. And you can check out their website at bethechangingz.org for even more super handy wellbeing resources. Now, over to the rest of the exec team. Hi, I'm Olivia, the Deputy Head of the International Council, and this is Harley. And we're here to announce that the winner of last week's competition was Ashlyn Banks, a Year 10 student who correctly identified all the countries that we have international students from. Congratulations, Ashlyn, you'll be getting a gift card once we're back at school after quarantine. The gift card was generously provided by Be The Change, so we'd love to give a big thanks to them. Yeah, you're recording. You got your recording on? I almost fell down. Minecraft. A beautiful world of spicy pixels. Yes. <laughs> Minecraft. The game I've never played. <laughs> Welcome to the Minecraft competition hosted by the Tech Council. Woo! Um, hello, I'm Disney Satoi. I am Deputy Head of Tech Council. And the freaking car just zoomed past! <laughs> Hello, I'm Fisni Satui, I am Deputy of the Tech Council, and we have a competition for all of you lovely people. Wait, did you say ugly people? I said lovely people! Oh. <laughs> Sorry! Minecraft competition. Build your own ideal sanctuary place. In these times of quarantine and COVID-19, it's nice to have an ideal place to escape to. So build it virtually and have a chance to win a $30 gift voucher! Free money! <laughs> Woo. The winner will get their voucher after lockdown and all prizes will be supplied by Be The Change. <laughs> they are a really cool group of people that provide youth and well-being on their website which is bethechangenz.org <laughs> The plug. I'm gonna put- I'm gonna put a link. <laughs> right here, Link. right right next to my head. You can work solo or in a team, however if you choose to work in a team you must split the prize. You can even go out and have a shared lunch. There are trois, three, three <laughs> categories you can choose Come from. <laughs> Design, functionality and creative. Design is like colours, symmetry and just like overall design of the place. Functionality is the use of redstone and Minecraft mechanics, and I just bonked my desk. Just freaking make it shake. So if you're really smart and can use redstone, go ahead and freaking have a crack at that. And creative is self-explanatory, the most creative and out of the box thinking or ideas. You can either take a picture of your creative space or a tour video, whatever floats your boat. Um, and just make sure to send the entries to moi, which is my, my email, which is Nicole16285 at avonside.com Whoa! Um, link in the um, description. Yeah, link in the description, guys! <laughs> but no, my email will be down in the description along with a link to the uh, Be The Change website thing. I keep looking off to the side, um, but it's fine. Um, deadline will be in 10 days, so from the 5th of May to the 15th of May. Get your entries in before then, to moi, and we will judge to accordingly, and you might get some free amula. So yeah. That's... yeah! <laughs> yeah! Peace. I don't know how to end this. <laughs> Have a good day in quarantine. Enjoy your life in quarantine. Stay safe. Protect those in your bubble. Hi again everyone, 
You may remember that last week we announced a Christchurch wide trick shot competition for the One School Network. This week I'm super excited to let you all know that our winner was Laura Behan. Well done Laura and make sure that you all like the Christchurch Secondary Schools community Facebook page so that you can see her skills and those of others in our wider community. Kia ora everyone, just a reminder that we have our Arts Council competition running at the moment. We want you to send to us photos, drawings or paintings of things that you are grateful for at the moment during this lockdown period. We've had some really great entries and it's really cool to see you all getting involved. Um, remember that every entry gets house points and the winners will get canteen vouchers. It ends this Friday, so get them in soon, get creative this week and we'd love to see them. Email them to me at holly16186 at avonside.school.nz and we'd love to see them come through. Thank you. Hey guys, it's Sal just speaking on behalf of the Sports Council, hoping everyone is staying safe, staying active and staying connected. The Sports Council just put a small video together to show a way that you guys can stay active and connected together and hopefully we can get back to school and get into the swing of sports again in the safest way possible. But yeah, hope you guys enjoy the video. and warm Pasifika greetings to you all. My name is Luceta Filiai and I'm also the head of Pasifika Council at Avonside Girls High School and this is our first video in Avonside Aroha. Uh, firstly, I hope you're all doing well and looking after yourselves in your bubbles. Um, I really do hope that we head back to school soon so we can get things going. Um, I just want to jump on here and uh, give our Pasifika students um, a few social media accounts that help your parents understand more about COVID-19. Uh, to begin with, we have NCA Male Pacifica. This is just a Facebook page that gives out key messages to your parents in regards to um, COVID-19 and uh, is specific for Pacifica parents. Uh, secondly, we have Project Y. This is another social media platform that does give out key messages for parents and uh, I personally know that there is a video on there in Tongan language in regards to um, how to keep updated with your children. So it's there to help you. So um, please do let your parents know that there are videos and social media platforms on Facebook for you. We also have an Avonside Bus Figure Facebook page and I apologize if you're not on it. I may have slipped past your name, but please do email me here Down here. I feel like a famous youtuber saying it, but please do email me down here and I'll be sure to add you in it uh, Apologies once again for um, not Adding you to it. I think that's about it. Uh, just jumping on here to let you guys know that um, we're still here But speaker council still here. We're just uh, coming up with ideas to um, present to you all uh, Also, um, someone language week is coming up uh, please do let me know if you have any ideas on how to celebrate Samoa Language Week uh, quarantine style, ISO style, um, as we do not know if we'll be back at school by then. So it's on the 24th of May, so if you do have any ideas, please email me down here again. <laughs> Sorry, I feel like a YouTuber. But um, yes, uh, let me know any queries, any information, anything your parents need to know, please do let me know and I'll reach out to our bus speaker teachers and then I'll get back to you. Um, thank you, Ofalahiatu. The Teaching and Learning Council would like to say a massive thank you to everyone who entered our competition. We asked you guys to send us new things that you've learned over this quarantine period. And we've had a range of answers from anything from baking new recipes to relearning knitting um, and even new dance move and 50 digits of pie. 
which is incredible. So um, we thank everyone for entering, but a special congratulations to our winner, Genesis Bennett. She told us that she learned some tricky math concepts that she had been struggling with. Um, so she wins a $30 Palms voucher provided from Be The Change. So thank you to everyone who entered and congratulations, Genesis.